You're exactly right, Neil. We felt a lot warmer over the last few mornings. Just this Monday, we actually had temperatures cold enough to cause frost across the entirety of the central coast. So something to keep an eye on with those continuously warming temperatures. But we're also seeing a lot more marine layer in our area at this point. That means some patchy fog. It is getting a little bit more widespread through the morning hours. That patchy fog is going to be most impactful, especially up in North County. If you're going to be driving in those areas, it's something to keep a close eye on it this morning and just take a little bit of extra time on those roads. Temperatures this morning morning for some of us in the 50s already 50 degrees in San Luis Obispo 39 in San Inez 45 in Santa Barbara only 30 degrees Coyama and California Valley in those interior valleys that's where we have the possibility of still seeing some frost this morning but overall great conditions for this morning but it is a little bit gusty this is what we're looking at at our current wind gusts at this point. Not a whole lot going on with our sustained winds. They're coming from the west right now, continuing that offshore push. They're going to get a whole lot more intense, especially by this afternoon. We could be seeing gusts upwards of 45 miles an hour in those passes and canyons, especially along the Santa Lucia's. Something to keep a close eye on. The really gusty winds we saw along our south coast yesterday have now moved their way up to San Luis Obispo County, and that is why we do have a wind advisory for sustained winds. 15 to 25 miles an hour, gusts up to 40 miles an hour. That could cause any branches to maybe have a little bit of damage to them. So something to keep a close eye on that is going to stay in effect through 9 a.m. But we're still expecting to see very strong winds throughout the majority of the Santa Lucia's throughout the entirety of the daytime hours today. Something to keep a close eye on. Temperatures today, not bad at all. 59 degrees in Paso Robles, 69 in San Luis Obispo, 67 in Santa Maria, 65 in Lompoc, and 67 degrees in Santa Barbara. It's just a little bit over that normal for this time of the year, so great news there. Checking out your area forecast in our North County today, Morro Bay, 68 degrees, 59 in San Miguel, Atascadero at 60 degrees, significantly colder as you head inland for today, but really pleasant and nice in those coastal valleys and along the beaches. 68 degrees in Napomo, 67 in Pismo Beach, 61 in California Valley, and 55 in Shandon. And along our south coast, as always, a little bit warmer than elsewhere in our area. 71 degrees in Solvang, 62 in Goleta. Really great conditions across the entirety of the central coast. Now checking out your microclimate forecast. Got that high pressure system moving down to the south. This decaying cold front's going to drop through our area, continuously dropping our temperatures down and bringing us a whole lot more cloud cover. And that tiniest possibility for some light rain for San Luis Obispo County over the next couple of days. So something to keep a close eye on. Then we've got another big cold front that's going to make its way here by early next week, but that's not going to bring us any rain either. Checking out your seven day forecast, a little bit more fog for tomorrow with those significantly cooler temperatures. But then by the weekend, another big high pressure system is going to make its way into the area, warming us up once again for some absolutely fantastic days for the week ahead. Neil and Janelle, back to you.